Arizona's two main political parties deciding where their futures lie, electing new party leaders. ABC 15's Mark Phillips reports Democrats hope to build on their election victories in 2020 and 2022, while Republicans hope a familiar face from their ranks can put them back in the winner circle. <coughs> In 2016, Jeff DeWitt helped raise the money to fuel Donald Trump's presidential victory. We are going to make America great again, everybody. I promise you, we're working so hard. This past weekend, the former state treasurer and Trump official became the new Arizona Republican Party chair, replacing Kelly Ward. We just want to get back to the basics of, of winning elections. Appearing on KTAR's morning show Monday, DeWitt said he wants to unify the party, raise money, and get Republicans elected. In 2022, enough Republicans voted Democrat or not at all that election deniers Carrie Lake and Mark Fincham lost in their key races. In his interview, DeWitt suggested support for candidates like those two won't necessarily change. On Sunday, he attended a rally for Carrie Lake. I just want every Republican to win. Doesn't mean, no matter who it is, forget last night, but no matter who it is, I'm going to be helping every Republican. It doesn't mean I believe in everything they're saying or everything they want to do. But overall, I believe that every Republican uh, should get elected over the other parties. Democrats are hoping to build off their victories in statewide elections. The party chose a union organizer, Yolanda Bejarano, to lead their party. She worked as a field director for the Communications Workers of America. My strategy for the party is to organize from the bottom up, not from the top down, and to field candidates in every race. While most Arizonans just want a break from elections, Preparing for the next one is already underway. Mark Phillips, ABC 15, Arizona.